What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of Canon Culture, your favorite entertainment commentary podcast with a life lesson towards the end. I'm here with all of my cohorts, and we're back after a long hiatus. Thank you guys so much for being patient with us, and thank you guys for sticking with us the entire way. We have more great things to come every single week, so we just want to say thank you guys for listening. Make sure uh, to rate this podcast five stars on iTunes. Also, subscribe to it if you are on Spotify. Of course, the podcast is available on YouTube as well as every other platform available to watch and listen to podcasts. So thank you guys so much. Enjoy the episode. How you doing, guys? Hello, hello. Welcome. Hi. It's good hello. to see all you guys. Hello. I missed you guys. I did it. DJ with the fresh cut. Yes, sir. Arrow with some lights on. I love to see I it. I had to do something. Yeah, had different to do something. background. That's yeah, crazy. Different, huh? different mic already. Oh yeah, you, he's not facing. He's not hey, man, facing. with that, not, with that $200 really webcam, good. man, I really can't see your $50 mic. That shit yeah. looks Honestly, great. honestly. Wow. Mike, you might wow. as well just use, Bro, just use your webcam mic. It's probably better. <laughs> oh, no. Do you want me to use my webcam mic? Yeah, no, no, sure. no, 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 no. No, switch it. Sure. I want to hear it. Hold on. No, bro. That, no, that ain't it. This this he part of the podcast is... He don't even have... A, this part of the podcast is brought to you by about? Arrow's cheap-ass... Oh, God. Oh, no, no. Turn that other one back on. Turn that if you one bought back Guitar on. Hero in the early 2000s, you could also have that mic. I thought he was going to say, if you bought Guitar Hero in the early 2000s, you may be entitled to compensation. <laughs> <laughs> Guitar Hero Live, I feel like I need some money. Oh my god. Oh man. Welcome back, guys. Welcome back. So, this one. Um, so anyway, before we jump into everything, how was everybody doing? How was everybody's weekend and everything else you guys went through? Any new updates? I've been working for nine days straight. I'm so proud of you, Selena. Nine days. Thank you. The block is literally I, I get hot. a day off tomorrow. Oh, Two days off. okay. Oh man. Okay. A pimp name slip back and give you a day off, huh? That's crazy. I'm gonna miss some overtime. Oh, I don't wow. use this phrase lightly, Selena, but they work in you like a slave. <laughs> Deacon's fire. They're um, they're thinking. I'm fired. Fired. That's me. Deacon's oh my fire. god. Next oh, month they're, they're thinking of having me do some twelve-hour shifts. Mm. I'm not. I refer you back nurse. to my previous statement. <laughs> Oh, I, no. I don't work in the medical field. Why the fuck am I going to be doing twelve-hour shifts at a fucking hotel? Because you're too Hello? valuable, they can't let you go. Yeah, I, they can't find anyone to hire. <laughs> they got exactly. they got people clocking out because of COVID. That's what it is. That must be what it is. So you know, it is what it is. That, that one hospital had all the doctors it. just walk out because they were. I need, I need. I seen that. I seen that. that. What is that? That was that was some crazy stuff. What? Um, no, I can't. I did I not hear some... about this. Yeah, yeah that, they walked. They, they literally walked out the hospital. The, the nurses, the, the aides, a bunch of people just say, all right. Can you whatever. imagine you're, you're, can you imagine you're on your fucking deathbed Florida and they're doctors. like, oh, I gotta go. And it's like, wait. Fucking Florida doctor, doctors. Doctor, where you going? Where you going? This is open surgery. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, that's messed up. That's messed up. That is messed up. Oh, my God. I just got out of surgery and I just saw all the fucking nurses walk out. I'd leave. I'd ask for a transfer. <laughs> Where everybody going? Transfer. Who's yeah. transferring you? Just give me a giant band. No fucking please. janitor at that point. I don't care who gets me out of that hospital. Just get me out. Of it. <laughs> wheel me out this bitch. God, give me my own. <laughs> give me a wheelchair. I'll do it myself. <laughs> Oxygen tank on. Just strap Arm that strength back about to be oh. oh my god. Fucking give me a razor scooter. Bro. Well, um, so I got a couple of updates, man. I got a couple of updates for you guys. Uh, Hello. So you guys know that my last, my last resort plan has now <laughs> failed. You know, it's what happened? Absolute, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I was not expecting that at all. That me I was not expecting that. I should have never now. gave Plank that power, bro. <laughs> no, Plank, yeah, absolutely. Put it I'm, back, man. Put it I'm gonna have to edit it. I'm gonna have to edit it out. That's it. I'm gonna have what? to edit no, it out. Yes, it sir. Is. Yeah, no. It gives a character. Ah, sorry. That's not. <laughs> These are two characters I do not I want. Can't believe you really did that. that is copyright did, did infringement. Do, this man put both his Twitch now? emotes up there. Oh my god! Did you yeah, this just now? Just now playing? Did you not hear yeah, me? Of course. Tell him to set up the virtual webcam. No, I did not. Yeah, they literally had like a two-minute tutorial going on. Oh. Nah, nah. I was nah, in the man. bathroom. <laughs> nah, nah. You were sitting there as they yeah. were, <laughs> unless you were shitting yourself on camera. You were here when it was happening. <laughs> 
Plank's gonna get a VTuber model of just Plank from Ed, Ed and Eddie Mason. I don't. I didn't know what he was talking about. That's what it was. I was just like, okay, so what does he need the virtual camera? I was sitting here for, waiting like? for it to throw it up to see like what he was gonna do. Oh, no. This man is a fucking menace. Jesus Christ! Absolutely. Next disgusting. week, can we all just do that? <laughs> can that be the podcast next week. Oh I my god. Talking. That's that's yeah. terrible. So. Anyway, uh, first off, I would like to say a big shout out to my friend Alexandra. Today is actually her born day, so happy birthday to her. She just turned 30, uh, 31. Um, old. Yeah. Uh, you know what? <laughs> uh, man, you ain't old until you feel it, you know? I'm, I'm feeling it now, motherfucker. You know what I found Look is very up. interesting, though, Arrow? <laughs> Women take age very seriously. Oh, really? Man. They really do. Selena, can you attest to this? Yeah, if you're older than me, you're old. I see? don't care. See? No see? matter what age I am, as long as you're older than me, you're old. Yeah, see, so very it's nice. it's very interesting because as I <laughs> as I have different conversations with her, you know, about like growth and improvements as a person, she's just like, Well, you know, it is what it is at this point. And she really takes everything <laughs> as it comes to her. And I'm just like, Are you good? And so, you know. Um, not only that, a lot. Me the midlife, the midlife crisis in there. Not only that, I noticed, I noticed right around this age, a lot of my female friends are suddenly stressing about like their like age is coming up in in the conversation. You know what I mean? I mean like a lot more. I didn't expect to be alive this long, so I don't know what I'm doing. Me anymore. neither. Me Back neither. What DJ said. Thirty two is your midlife crisis. You dying at sixty four. Hey, hey, why not like 15? for our generation? Yeah, what I'm doing. <laughs> for our generation, I to yeah, make it man. at least 18. You but start then having I wanted a, it to end there. You start having <laughs> a crisis at 18, 18, and I wanted to die. <laughs> if you start having these conversations with yourself, just I one has to I didn't know what like, to do after that. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. In between 22 to 25, you're definitely having at least three or four crises at that point. You make it, mm, you make it some wild, you make it some wild decisions with your money. Like, I don't know about three or four. I'm going to Turks and Caicos. Yes, sir. At least three. At least three. At least three. If you're not having some three. type of crisis in between 22 to 25, are you, you going outside? 22? Yeah. You have one at 23. I'm 22 next you have one at 24. And I'll if you figure you it out, you'll skip 25. Yeah, that's pretty yeah. much it. I've at least um, had six or seven just in my 20s. Just in my 20s. I might be, I might be bad off. I might be down bad here in, uh, in my life. In my Go outside year. and touch grass. I promise you, <laughs> no you're going to get stressed out. Okay. <laughs> if I touch I used the grass, to do this? yeah. If you yeah. if you go outside and touch grass, you see, will be stressed see, out. That's reality. People people forget how itchy grass is when you actually touch it. Oh my god, I fucking mm. hate. Yeah, no. I hate remember those. You remember, you remember those fucking grass those fire fucking itchy, bro. those fire drills where you had to go to the field and sit down for like a half hour. Oh yeah, you wore those, those were lit. Oh, no, they were not. I, I, used to I hated growing I up playing down. soccer, and whenever you're on the sideline, they're like, nah. Sit down. Sit in the grass. Sit in the grass. You're moving around too much when you stand. See, the thing, Plank, is we in California. So our fire drills happen to coincide with summer. Yep. <laughs> well, that sounds like a you problem. My, my problems are lit. I was I was in there. <laughs> my problems are lit. You ever, they had me play a, one of the survivors. You ever had a fire drill when it was snowing outside? I just, did you not just Actually, hear me say we lived in California? Sir, the thing we about living in ones. the no. thing about living in California no. is when you get a fire drill, you still not sure if it's a real if it's real or not. That's the, <laughs> the thing. The, the fire is the drill. <laughs> yeah. There's gonna be about six or seven kids with heat stroke outside. Uh -huh, you'd be like, damn, thing. you sure it ain't no fire? This is just a drill. That motherfucker lying. <laughs> no, he up there lying. This ain't yeah, assembly shit. Playing. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, it's so much. Oh, <laughs> It's so... We didn't have to worry about that. Ours was the tornado drills. I love me tornado drills. They always sent us to like the basement, and that's where the weight room was. So as everyone's piling in for the tornado drill, it's just the smell of sweat. <laughs> and you have say, like tornado drill. You just fucking write a letter and say goodbye. <laughs> no, Yo we're school's... fine. We're in the Yo basement. School's basement was the gym, like the yeah. workout. Y'all yeah. school like, had a it? basement. Yeah. We had to have a basement. We we're Kansas. Our That's Kansas. true. We legally have to have a basement. Uh, <laughs> our Kansas, thank you. Oh, our Kansas. I see. Our Kansas. I see. I see. In yeah. the middle of nowhere, you know, it'll it might and accidentally have, pick you like, up and throw you to somewhere useful. Class, gotcha. They don't care about the tornado drift, so they're over there still doing weight. So in the corner, you just hear. 
them like yelling as they're lifting weights. Like, why do you gotta yell? Was the movie Dude, Twister we're, we're like an autobiography or what's up? Dude, I was writing out my will. Oh, what are you gonna leave? Imagine being nine years old going out on a, on a fucking tornado drill. <laughs> Talking about, I gotta write my last will and testament. <laughs> I leave my Pokemon card. Please. Give my 24 one packs one of like crayons to my mom. My piggy bank should go to absolutely no one. Bury my me with it. My piggy bank. Part of that shit. My Game Boy. Uh, bury it. Uh, bury it. Bury it. My last $9 of allowance nobody can have. Bury me with that bitch. <laughs> absolutely not. Yo. That shit is nice. I don't know how much the fee is to heaven. <laughs> Please give me my money. And y'all think heaven got a cover charge? Yes. Oh, they have to. Oh, they want, how to, on... Bro, what are they charging? You think they want to? They pay hat, uh, tax, toilet taxes trees. in heaven. You got to bring your own towel. You got to be buried with a towel. There's not enough up there. They lost that part of translation. In the... <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck did Deacon, you get what? this from, bro? <laughs> Where the fuck did that idea come from? Like, of all things to have a shortage of in heaven, towels? Really? Towels. Oh, oh, okay, shit. hear me out. How many dead people are there? A lot. A lot. How many towels are there? Probably a lot. <laughs> Probably, <laughs> Probably not them. as much, though. Daryl, people have been point. around since the dawn of time. When were towels invented? <laughs> you, can, you, can, you, can, you can catch up. You can catch up. <laughs> What's happening? What, no, uh, this motherfucker did. Arrow's face. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what did they use before towels? Oh, it's not a heaven pool. Come on. <laughs> they use leaves. No okay. cap. It wasn't very effective. That's why they made yeah. towels. Oh the sun dried out there. Oh my god. Jeez, jeez. They ain't had a little rags on. Like the rags wasn't a thing. The loincloths? The, 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 the yeah, cloth yeah, joints? Yeah. Nah. You gonna, you gonna use you a piece wiping of cloth, your like, ass with the shit you were wearing? Come Jesus. on, bro. Let me dry myself <laughs> off and put it around. That's like using a t shirt to dry you off after a shower. Now we just gonna be bougie when we get through the gates. That's what we Yeah. That's the time to be bougie. Yes, sir. That's eternal happiness. All of the all of the amenities that you could not get, like a bidet, a PS5, you know, the the finer things in life, being able to clean your ass effectively. Some niggas don't really get that until they on the other side. So you know what? I get it. It makes sense. I absolutely understand it. So oh, you've been dirty your whole life. Who me? Some people. No, are. So, no I was Wait, saying what? those individuals. Those individuals have been have been dirty yes. since they've been crusty. Yeah, yes, there are a lot that's of homeless the people out there. there. Yeah. That's the fee well, into heaven. About... You have to explain to him how you took a shower. If you didn't wipe or clean your asshole enough, See, he sent you to hell. I I would There's like no to think about she's it. got a point. I would like to think niggas with skin marks. <laughs> niggas with skin marks don't get into heaven. Uh, I just I don't crazy. think they do. That's He's actually gonna ask you. Let me see. You got skin marks. Drop the draws. Wow. Little oh, do we know. Lost in translation. That's the eleventh commandment. Thou oh shalt not skid. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> got a little Nas at the front gate. Let me see. Turn around. Let Drop the draws. No. Down he, the pole. He puts on. He puts Down on the pole. Down the pole. <laughs> Let me see. Down the pole. Let me see. He puts, he puts okay, on a white good? glove and he goes like that. And if anything comes off, <laughs> he goes down and back up. Hmm. The fucking this, credit this card podcast is, is, this podcast is going to hell. No, I guess we get to this. He goes, he goes start asking you random ass questions. Go ahead and smell this. What you smell? Go ahead. What do you smell? What do you smell? <laughs> smell like you, you not. Remember? Smell like you going down that pole. Go ahead. You, you, remember, you remember what you ate three days ago based off this? Did you eat before you died? I just want to know, cause this looked like your fault. Mm-hmm. This looked like this Were you a prime. vegetarian? This is prime right here. Wait a minute. You this didn't die. go down the pole. You didn't eat enough fiber. Uh huh. Yeah. No, I swear I didn't. Uh uh-uh. uh. Down the pole. I don't uh-huh. know who you think you're lying to. Many there weeks don't count. The there is I don't know how this conversation started. All right, Jay, so back on those updates. You yes, sir, back on those updates. Um, you got way off track. You know what? That yeah, was... we did. I don't know. We did. I, so, I learned something. Um, as you guys may or may not know, I did take a... Uh, uh, we took a hiatus. Okay. A well-needed uh, yeah. hiatus. And um, I have to say, you know what? It was needed. I'm not going to lie to y'all. It was absolutely needed because uh, stressing myself out about getting... Driving through two hours of traffic through Calabasas and all of Los Angeles was a very tough time to try and get here on time. So now that we've established an actual schedule within the last... Yes, your mic is broken, brother. 
No, not me. I'm talking oh, okay. to chat, bitch. Oh, you were talking to chat. Damn. Wow. Okay. Well, fuck off then. Um, try to try to establish that schedule was actually really, 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 really tough. So now that we have one, we can like fully focus on the podcast and where everything else is going, and you know. Uh, the downfall of all my enemies. So you know, uh, I just want to say, oh, oh, I just want to wow. say thank you guys for riding this out. You know, yeah. thank you guys oh, for being yeah. patient with the podcast. You know, uh, so I'm looking forward to where we go with this, man. I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> so, you know, with that said, I got a new baby mama. Um, mm. uh, oh. yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. You mean we um, we got a new baby mama. Well, well, we, yes, we, yes, uh, we. Um, Selena is actually a co-conspirator. Communism. Um, I was gonna say, is this the podcast baby <laughs> mama? Is this between you two? <laughs> <laughs> you funny. Did I miss something? You funny. I just, I just need a new charging cord. Yeah, like, this, this is funny. not too much to ask for, right? No, I actually. Uh, so the girl that I'm seeing has a uh, a few cats that have had a litter. And I have a cat son oh. now. He looks like oh. a little cow. His name is El Jefe. Uh, oh, so... that's cultural appropriate. Is that a Hispanic cat? It, no, actually, it is is. That a... that's that's the thing. It is. It is. Oh, it is. <laughs> never mind. So you know, um, you know, it's gonna be very interesting to be a cat daddy. Yes, sir. I'm gonna be. I'm hey, looking that forward was a to... that was a banger back in the day. It was cat daddy. Cat daddy. Cat daddy. <laughs> yes, sir. That was that was it back then. Jesus. So. Um, you know, it, it, going into fatherhood, man, I'm I'm really excited. You know, this is only the second time I I was previously a dog dad until uh, my divorce. So you know, uh, Did we you finalize gonna... that yet, or what's up? You know what? No, no actually, okay. no. The paperwork is not signed yet. So um, who's, who's not sides. signing it? On both sides. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's it's actually real tough. Um, so there's no divorce. Well, how, how well is this... the divorce is in route. You know what I mean? The divorce is in route. So it's just right. how does this how does this even work? So in the in this particular situation, I'm gonna go ahead and out myself. So I, I still work for her father. So until that is kind of over, you know what I mean? The 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 situation is not it's not done. You know what I mean? Like yep. the divorce is not final. It, it's already been separation, but the divorce is not final. Mm. So you know, mm. yeah. She she kept so all the money and the, and 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 the, you know my son. So and what everything, what so. you're saying is you out here being a dad to another kid while you still married and have a kid on the other side? Sir, I'm a grown man. I take care of my responsibilities. That's all I heard you say. I feel like you're responsible for this divorce right now. Yeah, well, I don't know what to tell you, sir. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> things things take time. Yes, paperwork we'll and, 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 yeah exactly see? you're right yeah COVID's slowing down the process exactly too. see can't even get a good notary yep, out this close. bitch mm, talking about <laughs> i'm sick okay all right didn't you get the <laughs> shot you should be good that's crazy <laughs> so anyway um anybody else have any updates before i pour the rest of this drink i still uh -oh. got two kids i'm still trying to move i ain't got no kids so Deacon, I'm no crazy. what's going on oh, with yeah, that move? people think that oh. I got kids for some reason. You ain't um, got no kids, bald head. I don't. I really, I really ain't got no. no You're the type of nigga I would think to have some kids. Why is it me? Why is everybody saying this? Hey man, not when you have a crispy hairline though. Yeah. You don't look, look like, like you got you no make kids. Bad decisions. Yeah, you do. <laughs> you look like you don't pull out, brother. <laughs> I mean, that's crazy. There's at least two kids out there he doesn't know this about. This man said the club is getting shot up. Hello. I mean, I just, you know. Oh no! I mean, say hi. No, you good? Don't we? It's not your art. I don't even have fuck with rubber like that. It's, 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 I'm allergic. To, oh, I'm allergic to latex. Oh, I, I am. I don't. I don't. I don't. That's not me. Oh my god! What did you oh, ask me, Jay? Before DJ tried to DJ's about to turn into I Usher. You, I all 2022. You, <laughs> I gotta let it burn. <laughs> Ooh Ain't gonna be no burner out here. Right? Oh That's my god. Bad. None of that. Uh, Deacon, None I was asking, that. how's the move going, man? Oh, we good. I'm done with most of the renovations. We out here on uh, October 1st, so I'm just killing time now. Okay. Oh, I mm. oh, so right around the time OnlyFans is done doing it. What know. a coincidence. Is very oh, coincidence. You know what? I've never seen OnlyFans and Deacon in the same room before. <laughs> <laughs> I have. <laughs> I definitely have. I definitely oh, see both of them motherfuckers at the same time. Unfortunately, that was that was wait, real awkward. We're not gonna tell people. Wait, whoa, what anyway. was y'all? Whoa, 
So, okay. So, so actually, on. before we get into the Spider-Man stuff, I actually have a question. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this is before our generation, of course. Most of us are uh -huh. in, in between our twenties, mm -hmm. and me be you know bringing up the you know Jay's tail end, yeah. yeah, being a dad. Um, did y'all ever think it was kind of weird for the previous generation to share porn or like watch porn together? Is that weird? Is that sus? People did that. People uh, used Jay, to do that, bro. Do I, that. I was like, I feel like I was the last person to do that. Cause I'm not gonna lie, that was the thing, you know, when you're growing up. You're like, off to the same, I got... same people. No, nobody we're was not, jerking we're not off. Jerking nobody off. was jerking off. No, yeah, there, was not, there was away. There was not jerking off. Away. Yeah, no, Wait, no, no. So no, y'all no. was just watching it for viewing pleasure. Okay, so. <laughs> You just watch it like you watch in game. Time out. Time out. Time out. Did you time rate this? Did you rate the movie? J first of all, like down first have a discussion, it's not a movie. roundhouse discussion. Yeah, we broke you, out the coffee and had a round table. <laughs> <Was there> a <laughs> <review? discussion. laughs> you know what? Act four, scene three really had you know me what? going. Everybody, everybody, we're gonna leave this session and come back tomorrow with a five minute tomato score for it. There was a written book report. Okay, for for but cited our sources. Busty Broads 11, okay, was a, a cinematic me. masterpiece, okay? I'm going to tell this you that right amazing. now. Amazing. Yes, sir. Okay? Now, was second of all... <laughs> second of all, there's context to this, okay? Because back when I was like, well, let's see, what, what year was that? What year God, did the Cassie... I gotta do what year did Are Cassie you look up the you release come date? Out? I want to look it up because I remember, I remember having the homeboys over when when that video uh, dropped, okay, 106 and Park was playing it. And it was something unanimously in the room that happened during this music video where we all looked at each other and said, we do not tell anybody that we watched this video together. It was me and three of my homeboys. And of course we got together to watch 106 and Park as we usually do and pretend to do our homework and then proceed to play PlayStation. That's how it worked. You know what I mean? But, so I guess the NDA okay. just inspired. Uh, <laughs> I, I was thinking that while he was saying that, I was like, we can never tell anyone that this happened. As I told everyone that this happened. You, you, just, you just told. Now listen, oh, no. listen, 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 listen. Shut up. <laughs> okay. I know, now, I know I wanted to get to know some of you guys better, but not like this. <laughs> I don't need to know what book reports you've done, what movies you've watched. I don't care what the score you gave it. You see, Selena, that's very unfortunate because we're here now. So, Jay, go ahead. We'll see. So, anyway, like I was saying, to violate uh, an NDA that was set 15, yeah, 16, 18 years ago. The NDA. Um, so, it sounds about right. <laughs> there was something very different about the Cassie Me and You video. All right. Oh, there I'm looking this up right now. Yes, Hold sir. On. It's me and you. Now, I gotta be I've been waiting. I have to be that is They're gonna song. make a move. No. Uh, I don't okay. remember this. That song, okay, and the other one was the the Pussycat Dolls, okay. There was that one, and there was see uh, that that was that was a little wild. The, that video was a little wild. The Shakira uh, hips don't lie video, okay. Me and all my boys was just in it. In, yo, I had I I I looked at every single one of them, and we had realized that this was a different level of bonding, and I just wondered. This is the reason why I bring this up. I wonder if kids nowadays have those no. bonding type of moments where, no. I mean, not necessarily the same context, but like, I wonder if they have moments now where it's just like, oh, we homeboys forever. You know what I mean? Right, yeah, but it's different. Well, like, that was, you're taking that grave, you're taking that secret to the grave with each other because y'all in the same room doing the same uh, thing absolutely anymore. Absolutely not. Dick's, absolutely not. <laughs> Dick's <laughs> not out. Dick's not out. <laughs> No, um, I don't think they're, were never I don't think they're bonding never. over bronze. Dicks were never at 11. I don't think no. they bonding over that now. No, He's bonded over like cranking 90s or something now. See, see what, I, what I think is very interesting is the reason why, another reason why I bring this up is because I was watching, um, what TV show was that? It was, is this uh, NDA still up or what's up? The NDA is up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. exactly what it is. That's been um, expired. Yeah, it's been okay. expired about two, two and a half minutes ago. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, <I'm pretty laughs> Sorry, man. Sorry, man. So they got into the part of the movie where the story was like, oh, we said we weren't going to tell nobody. <laughs> that's right. Ben uh -oh. and Christian, that's my bad, bro. That's my bad. Um, Anyway, so Government uh, names. I'm just saying, so I was watching some show. I think it was either Black Monday or um, it's one other show on Showtime. The Deuces. That's what it was. And so it was, uh, 
I don't want to have to explain the whole damn show because y'all don't care. But anyway, at one point in time in history, in America, there were porn theaters. And people used to just go and openly jerk off in the movie theater. You know what uh, I mean? And it was just like... Weird. That's weird. It was a gray area. Yeah, it was weird. It was a weird time yeah, period, weird. man. It was like in between the 70s and the 80s and everything was like okay to do. And I'm just like... Uh, why was this okay? You know what I mean? Why? I just... If, I'm confused. If you're gonna have... If people, like... If you're gonna do something, might as well get everybody that's gonna do it in the same spot so cleanup's easier. What? Could you imagine going to a movie theater right now and seeing come on the back of a seat? Okay. No, I can't. Because there were specific movie theaters you for that, the, so you didn't you have to, to worry the wrong about movie it. You go to the wrong movie theater in the wrong neighborhood. I'm yes. saying, well, you don't have to go to that point. movie theater. It was a yeah. specific theater. You didn't have to worry about it. Yeah. You were in the clean section. Yeah, you not were the in the cum section. You, you, yeah, you were in the not dick out section. <laughs> I would hope so. See, it doesn't make sense to you, DJ, until you go to a movie theater and this scene. I think I'm gonna just watch one, two, three movies. All right, there you go. Wait, hold on. I would, I would hate to go see the new Spider-Man and and step in some cum, bro. That would be. Yeah. I'm not trying to sit in the chair and that shit leaks out the chair, bro. I'm not trying. Yeah, it's like soaked into the fabric. Not. Yeah. Not trying to do that. It's, it's, like, a, it's, it's, like, it's, it's like a wet sponge. You know when you like <laughs> when you squish a wet sponge and the water comes out? Except it's when you sit down. Where am I? Where am I? This is the cum zone. <laughs> is this Earth too? <laughs> the cum zone. Hold on. I gotta change. I gotta change the text now. This was this was a Nexus event when I decided to to to, to change the, <laughs> the podcast topic. <laughs> Is it sus to share porn with your homeboys? No. Cause... No, because we do it, don't we? You what? see... <laughs> you said Why what? the fuck you snitching, you said... bro? <laughs> Why are you snitching? <laughs> you are snitching. Guess who will not be back next week on the podcast? <laughs> Guess who will not be back next week on the podcast? This man straight up snitching about the group chat. No, it's not. It's not even a. It's not even a secret. Wait, group chat. It's, uh, well, it's not chat. no secret. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about a group chat. I'm talking about a regular Twitter. Oh, Wait, you, you, no, 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 no. Oh. You, you, no, 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 he said, I'll send you the invite. Yeah, this Wait, is weird. He, you he was like, no, 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 no. That's your fault. That's you. It's a group chat on... Uh, I'm not so you guys play Evo? I, I, listen, first of all, there's not a group chat, okay? It's more of a group setting where chatting uh, happens. That's what I'm saying. It, yeah, so it's, it's all offline. It's, it's all offline. offline. We exchange yeah, yeah. flash drives. <laughs> See, that's exactly what it is. See, I'm, <laughs> I make the drop. I go to the Chick-fil-A off of Redondo. And uh, PCH, you know what I mean? Y'all be and... dead dropping the porn. Yes, sir. Yes, <laughs> yes sir. It's gonna be under the mailbox it's, on the uh, third. It's actually it's, it's, it's geolocating. Yeah, I don't know nothing he's talking about. Yeah. Disclaimer: I don't know. It's very secret. Okay, so you know them back back at you know archive data mine only fan stuff. Yeah, see that's we you know we getting into it a little bit. It's not illegal because it's all within you know a go- a single Google search, which means it's not illegal. If you can find it on page one of Google, it's not illegal. Now, if you got to like, dig what? for it, then, you know. Then you better stop digging. Yeah, the second you hit page two, that's how you know you're hitting some illegal stuff. That's what page I'm saying. Page two of Google. Who page two that? of Google, everything is illegal, bro. That's back page. Hey, when I was that's back page. Like, homework answers, okay. Nope. Oh, my about, God. I don't know about anything Mm-mm. else. Mm-mm. I could homework never. answers. That is definitely that's not That's no cap. They were really there, though, too. Yep. You be finding them shits on the Quizlet. That shit oh, was yeah. Yeah. I don't know what the yes, fuck that sir. is. You got me lost on that one, man. What always made me mad was the, the odd answers for math questions were in the back of the book. Oh, yeah. That, that well, was why fire. would they not okay. include the even ones? I just That's didn't what understand. I'm saying. Like, like, answer number two and number four just didn't fucking matter? Like, are you serious? Bruh. Bruh. No, that bullshit. shit was fire. I would always do that. I'd always take the, the, the odd ones. Just fuck it. Nah. They didn't even, I'll... teachers really didn't even check homework like that nah. anyway. They just looked at it. They just seen that you did mine. it. My teacher got mad that I but, never yeah, took okay, my Okay, so here, but here's my question: Did they ever make an evens book? 
Is there is there a book with the Eevees in the back? Yeah, it's like a fucking first edition you know Hollow Charizard. I feel like that's a legendary yeah. tome sitting in a tomb somewhere. That's man. called the that's called the be. teacher's with edition. All, with be. all the even yeah, answers literally. and shit like just, that. Just just buy the teacher's edition of the that's book. They it. got all the answers. Yeah. Uh uh. Mm -mm. That's got all the even answers of the Ten Commandments on that bitch. So what you telling me is they ain't even smart. They just looking in the back of the book and getting the answers. They don't yeah. smart. I mean, That's most of them can do the yeah. the work. Most yeah. of them. Hey, job you just to you, teach you. You're a teacher. If you don't true. teach me right, then you ain't doing your job. Hey man, I guess I guess we're I'm not in the school job. system anymore. What's the matter? Yeah, no cap. It yeah. kind of matters to me because my son El Jefe is going to be going to school in a shut couple the of fuck. years. They're going to right. shut up. <laughs> All right, and I just want to know the that the curriculum up. is, my is kids up to standard, so, so they're not getting anywhere because I'm teaching them. They're going to send this cat to a fucking so fuck. school. They got fucked. My cat birth. can walk on a leash. Like that's the only. I really want Jefe to be able to do that. I really want him. Dude, to it's be... great. Yeah, so I, really I don't walk her like around the block, but like I'll put a leash on her and we'll go walk in our yard. She likes it. So it took a while, but she likes it. Okay. All right. Oreo, on the other hand, um, he eats plastic. Oh, I don't know what to do about that. Speaking of eating plastic and trying to find a job, uh, did you guys hear about uh? Oh, oh love shit. me! Yeah, I knew he love was love me. Oh. Yep. Yeah, I mean, listen, I I had to. I had to. Right before the Spider-Man trailer, I wanted to talk about this. Okay, so yeah, OnlyFans is now boring. Bor boring. They're boring. Okay. They are boring. They're boring. Yes. yes, they are boring. They're banning <laughs> pornographic material starting October first. Now, um, according was... uh, according to this article uh, on Variety dot com, uh, they're doing it be specifically because they're trying to remain compliant with a lot of the banking standards that are set up in the UK. So specifically MasterCard, Visa, any company like that, American Express, Amex, no longer yeah. want, yeah, Amex no longer wants to process uh, transactions of that variety. Uh, so why? Th thoughts and opinions on this, fellas. Porn's like the biggest selling thing on the internet. Why would you want to do that? Yeah. I, think, I don't know. Uh, so it's like I, I don't know why they didn't do it before not wanting like... to process through OnlyFans transaction. Or what was it? Um, essentially, that they're trying to remain compliant. Uh, basically, it comes so that, and still works for this. Yeah, but they're trying. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh my god, they're trying to stick to some type of uh, what is it? I think they're trying to get funding for something. Hold on, I'm, I need to scroll through the rest of this oh. article. With as yeah, much money as OnlyFans only only is pulling in. So the, yes, OnlyFans as a company, they're trying to not only be more friendly towards advertisers, but they're also trying to attract. You see, uh, that's top tier see, that's donors. That's it right there. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. it. Every time a site tries to go for advertisers, everything just goes downhill, bro. YouTube, is a that, YouTube did that, YouTube and that shit that went. I'm terrible. surprised Twitch hasn't had some type of adpocalypse yet they have it's called the dmca police they have had an adpocalypse channels have been like banned. last year yeah what the fuck mm -mm. i should think you, you don't remember it was uh it, it was during uh the <laughs> my lights went up uh, it was, it was sub i think oh, it was sure. september right was they were just like oh yeah yeah, we're gonna yeah, yeah yeah they were like they started saying oh yeah oh, we, on. we're putting on ads on your shit and we don't give a fuck about your consent we're putting oh, yeah. ads on your shit they just do that to everybody now anybody yeah, literally everybody. Yeah. So now you have to run ads, basically, as a bigger streamer. Either yeah. run ads or you you hold pre rolls. It, well, it's I mean, pre rolls are gonna hit regardless. Um, if you yeah. run ads yourself, they're gonna disable pre rolls for different amount of times minutes. depending on depending yeah. on how long the ad is. But yeah, they're just gonna run shit if you don't, and they'll just take the money. Yeah, so. I mean, like everyone likes money, so you you can run the ads. Yeah, you don't want to make as yeah, but much didn't. Money off ads. Didn't OnlyFans come out because Patreon was like, well, we don't want any nudity or anything anymore. And OnlyFans, uh, like, and then oh, OnlyFans we'll, we'll take you. We'll take you, your nudity. Now we'll take everything. Two billion. But then they did that just to like get it and, big. And then like, where is that now? And then, now and then like, we oh, take their money and, and they're like, get out of here. Yeah. I know, as much, money as, as much money OnlyFans brings in, bro, they don't really need advertising. Like, I don't think they need it. It ain't about what you need. It's about what they want to do. They want yes. ads. So they want the ads. I mean, they were projected to make what two billion? So yeah. Fucking. They want more. I don't understand why. Because I don't know. They got you can never have, you can this never is have America. You can never have too much money. I don't know, man. Once I have like a, a set amount, I'm set, bro. 
I mean, I, get I, that, I, don't, but... I don't see money as like, oh, end all be all. I just like, you, you know, what? keep chasing it. It's because we're not in that same tax bracket. You get to a point where it's like, bro, if, if I make more money, I could pay less. Half a million. Oh, Somebody damn. I want that other half. No, I want exactly. the other half. You want that other half. You don't fucking half I me. I guess. It's just like that, but they, they playing with bigger money. Yeah. Like they cutting yeah. checks for for millions and millions, hundreds of millions of dollars. Yeah. They want and human half. lives, too, for some reason. Because it's going gonna, it's gonna to mean, fuck up with a lot of people, because this I think OnlyFans is a lot of people's, like, career, you know? I think, I think it is, actually. And all that stuff off that. Yeah. I mean, exactly. they can transfer to, like, other sites it's not like only fans is the only thing it's just like yeah but it was only i guess for the fans. it's weird to say but only fans okay. is kind of a uh what's the monopoly. word i'm looking for monopoly of, not, no not monopoly systemic racism it, mm? what <laughs> uh fuck what's the fucking word for it i can't remember it but like everyone no, no, knows no. only fans right it's ubiquitous it's, it's, if you're on the internet, you know what OnlyFans is. It's we joke about it literally every day. Like, we just know Nudity. about it. Um, if you have a following on Only OnlyFans, you can probably make a following somewhere else with the same people. If you are yeah. good, if you are good. But OnlyFans um, lets you pay per view. I think I'm pretty sure there's other sites that do that though, right? Yeah, you can. But at I the think same time, a, I think it's a subscription thing though. But you, you gotta real you gotta think like there's there can be no barrier to entry for OnlyFans if you just make it free and charge per post. Other other sites there's probably there's probably a requirement for you know minimum monthly payment or you know their cut might not as be as good what they make off of it all that. Uh, some other site would like tweet it out like uh fans they were for like sex workers was that them yeah they so. tweeted out like they were for sex workers and all this stuff and they was basically telling them. They gave him the Suge Knight speech, but it was like, you tired of your producer dancing in the videos, come to death. That's pretty much what they said. They're visiting you in the hospital room going, yeah. this could have been you, bro. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> Gotta get you out of that contract. Exactly. So that As, that could be the new site. We don't know. It's only time's going to tell, honestly, because like, God, when did OnlyFans start? I don't know. They they said that they were actually look looking for a wave. OnlyFans been up so for like, a minute. Only fans yeah. been up for a while. Yeah, man. Let me see. Let me see. It's nothing new. Sorry, I had, to, I, for a I had to, to check like the dance around it, too. So you good? I don't Only know how fans they do that. Started in 2016. Yes, sir. 16. Yes, sir. But when did they get big, though? Because I don't think it was until recently. Uh, 2019, oh. man. 2019. Yep. Like and then they, right? and then they got even bigger when Beyonce says something about starting the OnlyFans. Nah, mm-hmm. they they came up off the Rona, mm-hmm. man. They capitalized off Rona was really Hello, a different time. That demon time thing or something? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. She might start mm-hmm. out only fan. That that verse right there, that was it. That was it, man. That was the verse how that really. How much do you think OnlyFans paid her? Not nothing. Nothing. I, I think she was just nothing. she was, I think she she was, was just actually said that. Yeah, she was just riffing. Mm-hmm. That was it. And then after that, I mean, honestly, the pandemic really put people in a in a tough spot. So, yep. you know. I mean, that was my, that was, I'm going to be honest with you, man. If, if nothing else was going to work out, your boy was going to be up on the fans. I promise you. I absolutely promise you. There's no way I could not bless the world with, with the BBC gene. Yes, sir. I, I had to. I absolutely had to. Sir. <laughs> Busting it down on the fans. Yes, yes sir. sir. I was prepared to bust it down on the fans. Absolutely. Because, you know, I got a lot to, literally a lot to offer the world. Thank you, Dad. Hey, you're going to have a sale uh, uh November 29th. Is he there? No, what? my dad's not dead. No. Oh, why are you Because <laughs> I just want him to know. Big... Wow. I'm trying That's to pay, res- trying to pay respect to my... No, I'm trying to pay respect oh. to my father. Okay? Hey, yo. It's not my mom oh, who man. gave me a big cock. That's for sure. Right. My mother is not responsible it. for this. Uh-uh. It was definitely... I get... Shit. You know what I... Hey, man, you know say... what the funniest <laughs> shit was? I was telling the same joke to a friend of mine. She said, you got your daddy's dick. I said, bitch, what? <laughs> that's I don't think that's something you want to hear. <laughs> I, was like, I was just so appalled, and there's not really much that shocks me. But when she said that, I was like, "How do you know? How <laughs> fucking you know? dare? How fucking dare you? What the you fuck are you gonna say? This is crazy. How you know? How you, you fucking my dad? How you know? <laughs> you fucking my dad? <laughs> is you fucking my dad? 
That is very concerning. <laughs> that oh, is very man. concerning. That's, very concerning. So, That's funny. Um, but I do want to clear up one thing about OnlyFans. I do want to clear up one thing before we go any deeper. Uh, that I have oh. read through their like terms and conditions. No, sir. I'm trying to go deeper. Unpause. Fast forward. I'm okay. trying to get past this. Okay. Um, <laughs> check this out. So uh, after reading their updated terms and conditions, okay, a lot of their stuff, specifically when they say explicit, we're talking uh, like defecation, okay. Uh, yeah, hardcore any, kinks. Yeah, hardcore kinks, you know, like super, like hardcore BDSM, uh, bukkake people stuff. People shitting on the fans? Bruh, yeah, there are people shitting on the fans, bro. That's um, nasty. Any forms of necrophilia, any more, any of that hardcore shit. There's fucking dead bodies on OnlyFans. Bruh, you'd be surprised, okay? You would be very oh. surprised the amount of stuff that is on OnlyFans, sir. Now, oh. ooh, excuse me. Now, I will say this. My business is absolutely almost unaffected, but it's kind of been fucking with my clientele. So they're a little shaken up. They're like, should we go to this fansly thing? And I'm like, you were not already on it? Why are you just now telling me this? <laughs> this is not, I don't look like good management staff if you've only been participating on one fucking platform. And they're like, oh, uh, should we get a Twitter too? Bitch, what? Like, you should have been had a Twitter. So, you anyway, ain't had a Twitter. It, it's a long story. I'll tell y'all off the podcast. Anyway, so all it is to be said, man. This is really fucking up the game because uh, as OnlyFans came in here and revolutionized porn stars and just people at home being able to make money, um, this is this is very interesting because uh, OnlyFans has become a pop sensation, specifically popularized. All of these other sites oh, and stuff like that, yeah, like all these other sites and stuff like that don't nearly have the notoriety that OnlyFans does. Yeah. So I'm hoping this will be... You know, what was it, 2013, 2014, Tumblr all over again? So, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I forgot that exists. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah I know, not, right? Not no no more. Tumblr not as a no whole more. or the change in their fucking terms of <laughs> yeah, both. Yeah. Both. both. It's going to be both. both. I hope at not least OnlyFans is going to wise up and be like, you know what, we're going to reverse this. But the damage is done now. There are people actually like moving off the platform. And what's interesting is all of a sudden there's this huge influx in. The amount of women having promotions all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. I don't know if y'all have noticed. The, of course, the I know going you know. out of uh, the going sale. yeah going out of stock sale. Everybody's having like three dollar sale here, three dollars. Bitch, your products are digital. Yeah. Why you are don't you don't run out of stock? They don't run out of stock. Like, what are you? Y'all, you having sales like Coochie going out of business? Not only that, aren't you just gonna re-upload all that stuff onto the new site anyway? So. <laughs> They might yeah. not be that smart. I mean, they ain't have a Twitter. This one girl, well, she said, I'm giving a Dropbox of all my content. Before. And $7. I, for $3. Oh. And she's got over 1,200 just videos, bro. Just Let me videos. do some math real quick. We're doing some okay. math real quick. Let me get the calculator out. Yes, sir. Go ahead. And so all right. um, as Let's Deacon see, does those calculations, yeah, over 1,200 videos. Okay. Right um, so... She's Oops, giving away all this content because she wants to start fresh on her Fansly account. And I'm like, hmm. Won't that account just be fresh as you post things to that new website? Some people don't are aren't versed in like the art of thinking. So I mean That's sometimes you gotta spell thinking. it out in black and white. That's a quarter of a penny per video yes, at sir. that rate. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. A quarter of Not a quarter. Not even a whole penny. That's the, this is the Great Depression of Coochie. <laughs> the Great Coochie Depression is upon us. Yes, sir. I love it. Times are great. And, uh, you know, I do think it's a little fucked up how some people are taking this opportunity on the internet to kind of, like, poke fun and make, it, you know, like, be funny with women and shit like that. Like, oh, you bitches gotta get a real job and blah, 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 blah. I think it's a little fucked up. I'm not gonna they lie. They ripped yeah. that Fortnite streamer apart for saying that. Ooh. Yeah, that shit was... Mm -mm. Oh, I think, think that was a right, stupid right, thing right. to say. Yeah, it was ninja. Yeah, it is. Oh, it was is. it? it was a ninja? I don't, I don't know. Oh, no, I was about to say, like, ninja. that doesn't sound like something ninja would say. No, it, it wasn't. It was some motherfucker other, it was said, some come on and guy. floss with me in the middle of Times Square. You don't think he'd say something like that? You OnlyFans bitches gotta get a real job. That sounds like ninja. Yeah. That sounds like him. Maybe like I, don't, early I, just I don't understand saying that when you play games for a living. Well, yeah, that's a tough one. I got I got to crank 90s all day and drink chug jugs. 
Oh my god. Yeah. You don't uh, understand. Uh, it's Fortnite. Some, some women got to crank 90s me. all day and guzzle cum. So what's the difference? Sir. Sure. Junk taste good. <laughs> you have experience, buddy? <laughs> what are you drinking? Hold on. What is in what? your cup? Explain what? that, young man. Okay. Explain what? that. I can't. How you know? Y- y'all got that, bro. I y'all said chug drugs, not the cum. So you yeah, telling me you cum doesn't taste experience. good? Is that I what you're saying? No, I, haven't, I haven't tasted it. Hey. Yeah, no, hey, no. hey, you better clean up. You better <laughs> hey, clean up no. that motherfucking statement. You better I'm clean like... that shit up. Mm. Clean it. Anyway, so the last thing uh, is a little special. I don't know if you guys. Uh, I'm gonna repost it in the chat. Um, I came uh, across this. This last thing comes from a tweet uh, from your man, Just Jay Sama. Oh my God, I'm playing. I'm playing it on stream. I'm playing it on stream. <laughs> this is not okay. I mean, it, it is stream oh, safe. Shit. Just the audio is not stream safe. So I'm gonna go ahead and put hold on. This... Can we break that apart? Yes. It's stream safe, but the audio is not stream. The safe. audio is not is technically not stream. She was giving that dog if, dog. if the grapefruit technique can be <laughs> oh, played you're on talking stream. About that one. Yes, so I oh, tweeted out. Oh. I tweeted out because I saw this video of this young lady who was uh throwing it forward. This, okay. This demon. Yes, the semen this demon. demon. <laughs> she was throwing it forward, right? And uh I, I caught a lot of flack for this. Like, there was two people in particular who DM'd me after this. And they were like, oh, God. what does this mean? Um, so the tweet says, you know, uh, this woman is a demon. Now, I sent, I put, I put it in the chat so you all can watch the video for context. Yeah. Please go ahead and take I mean, your time. I, 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 I can't. I, can't. I, would, I, would, I, I already <laughs> seen it. So, let me, let me mute my I tweeted out. I tweeted out. <laughs> That, that, starts, that starts making me want to do like it's 11 11 make a wish type stuff. <laughs> so i tweeted out today i said this must be a hot take but all the sound effects when getting top absolutely turns me <laughs> look at <laughs> you can you know <laughs> i said all the sound effects is just absolutely not necessary and it's a turn off okay what this is shit he don't doing even, this shit don't even feel good ma'am get off me <laughs> Now I'd like to ask the podcast. Go ahead, Deacon. What was you saying? You didn't send me no fucking throwing it forward. This is a fucking scene from The Exorcism. What is this? <laughs> That's what I said. That's exactly what, what I said this? to a particular young lady. I said I don't really like it when it sounds like a young lady is having an exorcism on my on my you know <laughs> on my situation. Okay, so now I just wanted to present to the podcast when uh, giving and or receiving sloppy top. Okay, because I don't know what y'all do, Deacon. Okay. That's uh, great. Yeah. Deacon out here reaching. Deacon the one over here talking about, oh, cum don't taste good. So, listen, I'm just saying, I'm not trying to discriminate. Does anybody mm-hmm. else feel turned off by that sound? Okay, this could be, you know, for Selena, for the ladies, you know, when when a man is, is doing his thing. Is he making a whole lot of noises, or he can't Man, breathe, me, or something I, like I've that? Seen you know it what I mean? The TL without the audio, so let me go ahead and. Let bro, me... no, all right, all right, here we go. I want to bro, see this reaction. In the middle of that, the middle towards the end, it sounded wait, like she was like summoning Voltron watch or some the shit. Wait, like, it was as just... soon as I heard the <laughs> I was like, I Jesus. Eighteen <laughs> seconds, bro. Just let me, let me, let me see. Let me see this, because I, because I, I. It's in a canon culture, but in one of the threads. Okay, all right. So you know yeah, when you're going to plunge a toilet, right? And I, you can't I get you. it. Yeah. I, I called it. We were playing charades and I got you. Yeah, oh my yeah. Gosh, what the fuck? Hey, yo. <laughs> hey, hey, yo. <laughs> now I ask. Now I ask to both the people in the chat and, and in the... Listen, hey, hey. Somebody said, you know, if you're up in the coochie and it don't oh sound like God. sperm spaghetti, it's, it's bad. Uh, which I agree with that. But oh God, um, I didn't like it when she sped up. <laughs> see, <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but when I am receiving my top, all right, I don't like it to be sounding like the young lady is having a demon Wait, expelled from say? her body. She said words. Oh, I didn't even watch that far. <laughs> I didn't watch that far. 
You in the post credits? You in the post credits right now? In the post credits scene. Look at her, bro. Uh, an issue that was, if you have to ask them to look at. Look at me. Type of voodoo. Look at That's me. Type of voodoo. Bro. She did have that deep of a voice. Hold on. That is some type of. She she really said, "Look at me. Look at me. Look at me." Miss, I am the demon now. I am the demon. Bro, Jay, I'm just gonna say this. I thought I was in the mechanic, bro. I thought someone trying to start a car in that room. I would be, I would be very, I would be very concerned. Like when she was finished, I would think a, a piece of me was missing. Like I wouldn't even want to. She took a bite out of you. She took a bite out of you, bro. I would not feel like myself after I've, that. I've, I know the phrase "suck the soul out of me," but she was really trying to do it. I think she did. <laughs> This has only ever happened to me twice. He was so, dead. This has only ever happened like to me that, twice like that? where a young lady was making this exact, yes, these exact sound effects. And that's when I knew I don't like this shit. I don't like this. Huh? Now with them scrawny ass legs, bro, you know I'm thick. All right? You didn't see my calves when I get up and I walk away when we play in Apex. Don't act like it. Okay? You know exactly what the fuck I look like from the waist down. Thank you very much. Uh, what? Thank you, Dad. Anyway, oh, no. so so oh, check this no. out. Check this out. When this type of stuff happens to me, I just give up. I give up all hope. I ask this young lady to go home. Man, no, th ma'am, no, thank you. Whatever you doing, I need you to stop. Oh, you don't like it? No, ma'am. My my I'll penis is now yes, my I'll penis is now retracting leave. into my body. I have a coochie now. Okay, I need you to go home. You How need much to go home. To drive here? I'll pay. I'll cover it. On your way you home, right now. I need you to stop at not one but three churches. Not churches, <laughs> chicken. Okay, you need to go see a pastor, a rabbi, and whatever the fuck the Muslim people got. Okay, you gotta stop and and talk to fine? somebody. Okay, you need help. You need help. Okay, I'm gonna keep. Hold up. Yeah, $45. I will pay for the exorcism. Forty-five dollars. Go get you some therapy because whatever you got going on, you are clearly hurt. You are clearly emotionally hurt. And for any man that likes this type of shit, bro, you you are a different individual if you like your top to sound like this. Okay. Yeah. I was scrolling through these comments. Okay. I was scrolling through these comments and I was looking at the stuff some of these gentlemen were saying, and I was horrified. I was horrified. Good. One guy, one gentleman said, <laughs> "Stop!" I'm gonna be like, uh, hey. <laughs> "I'm like, bro, how do you, how do you type that?" <laughs> you just it Google was Translate it was a video. A it was a video. I could pull up the video <laughs> if you want. It with a video. I could I could pull up pull up the video if you want. A good old fashioned YouTube response. One one guy he actually made a live reaction in the Twitter thread. Okay, as if it was a TikTok type video. He said, All right, y'all, we're gonna watch this video. Oh my god. And this man just he recited an entire scripture. He said Psalms 316. You know, da 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 da. May God bless this woman and everything that she does and everything that she touches. Okay, and I said, Sir, I don't think that's the scripture. He ain't moving or moaning, soul's already gone. I don't I don't think that's the scripture at all. Ain't no ain't no use for prayer now. Okay, that brother is gone. No, he was gone. She was over there like, look at me. That brother me. is gone. Yeah, this look woman turned on the demon time. He said, look me in my fucking eyes. Look me in my eyes right now. Your I'd be scared for my life. Mm -mm. I'd have to change my locks afterwards. Mm -mm. Change your locks. You got to move. I'm moving. You got change to relocate. My identity. Witness protection. Okay, if any woman is coming after me like that. Oh, no. Take it with you. Sir, I don't need it. Sir, Take you don't understand. She was the lady in the video. I oh. gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> Take it with you. Take it with you. I don't. I don't fucking need oh, it. Um, God. But in particular, I don't. I don't. I don't ever want this to ever happen to me again. again. I don't most. even think I can make those sounds. Hello. <laughs> you stuck. We don't know what to tell you. Yo, uh, Twitter's I, I, fucking free, bro. Yeah, yeah, Twitter. Shit. Twitter. I can't is believe it every free. day. Yep. Told you, told you four so, days ago, Jay. That app is burnt. Yep, it absolutely is. I mean, uh, as soon as they announced Jesus. that OnlyFans was gonna have some issues, all of a sudden Twitter lost its mind. So, okay, you know, this is yep. this is where we're at now, I guess. So, but I don't want to be here anymore. Yeah, no thanks, no thanks, me either. I need off this planet immediately. So, 
Okay. Um, speaking of getting off this planet, let's talk about something very interesting that I know all of us can relate. Yes, sir. Um, we're not talking about the thing that you're talking about. Oh, please, please. <laughs> I was going to say Just for you, I'm going to save it for last. Just for there you. There you go. Um, I do want to talk about this article I found on Kotaku.com. Uh, <laughs> that... T- <laughs> About the Spider-Man trailer. Okay. All right. Look at the smile on this man's face. He said, ooh. Just for me? Hey, All right. I, my language. I have not seen the Spider-Man trailer, so I have decided to opt out of this conversation. Deacon does not watch well. Marvel movies. Uh, because uh, No, I haven't seen the trailer. I watch Marvel movies. He does not trailer. watch Marvel movies because every time I ask him about something Marvel related, he claims he does not know. Those are TV shows. Thank you. Pussy. There's... T- you know what? That's all. All right, right you pussy nerds. So, uh, the rest of you Marvel nerds can can please proceed with the rest of the conversation. Yeah, that shit was cool, B. There you go. That's that's <laughs> it. That's it. We know. We know. I mean, it was how, y'all. How, y'all got that. Uh, I'm out of my element. So I was gonna say, how y'all gonna talk about this? It came out like 20 minutes ago. But it was. It was- it was okay. Seen. There's so many details, bro. Listen, oh there's God, so many details. The internet has so many details. They, it was a, it was like a two and a half minute trailer or something like that, right? Spoilers. I, like I don't know. What, I don't know how many, how many minutes it was because I was oh. thoroughly in the throughout the whole. You're gonna tell me Spider Man in there, and I gotta expect him in the movie. What the fuck? Uh, they they called yeah. it a teaser trailer. So what's the full trailer gonna be? Uh, Four one minutes? where they showed the actual plot line. Did they not? Or where they give away too much of the like, movie? Those know, are my favorite. Yeah, trailers. that one. Those are my favorite that trailers one. where they give away the entire plot movie. line. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I mean. You know, I don't want to spoil it, but you know. Dang, we can't even talk about that because we're gonna spoil it for yes, people. Yes, you ain't can. Seen. Just, but just talk about it. If you ain't seen so it by the time this podcast, people. man, I don't give a damn. This is their this it's is a their trailer. spoiler warning. It's, it's a too trailer. late now. Hey, all three Spider Man mm-hmm. showed up. I'm just joking. Okay, okay, well, now I can't watch the movie. <laughs> what the fuck? But he's what the fuck? I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. That didn't, I knew that you happen. was a bitch. Didn't I didn't know you were that, that big of a bitch. Oh that didn't God. happen, Deacon. Okay. I would have no. I didn't see the trailer. Oh, now crazy. I can't now watch I it because all three. I did have to see it. I said left alone. Huh? Hey, listen. Mm-hmm. That shit is cool. Go watch it. That's it. That's. Mm-hmm. I turn your no. fucking camera on. I mean, I I'm not turning my camera on. I don't want to be that person. Like. I don't want to be that person. I'll so, watch it I right mean, now. And talk hold about on, hold on, hold on. Time out, time out. There's not really much to say. It is what it is. So you mean to tell me, you mean to tell me, I set you up for a pretty yep. good transition. Yep. And you not going to talk about this bum-ass trailer? Yep. Bum. Bum-ass bum. trailer. Yeah, because you're not telling me the details, so I have to bro, assume this, it's this, a bum-ass trailer. This is the greatest nah. trailer. Really, speak on it then. Tell me why. Let me tell you something. When Green Goblin came out the cut like that, I didn't know what to expect. Is that Doctor Strange? Oh, no, you did. Oh yeah, my is. God! Yeah, this Strange. man put yeah, the Dr. trailer Strange. in. The... Listen, listen. Yeah, let me yeah. tell you something. Man. I. You know I what happened? I'm a... no. Before you go, Jay. Before you go, literally, they took a page out of like Men in Black with the little neural flash thing. That's what happened. That's what happened. You don't get the reference? No, no. So what happened when they when you remember when in Men in Black they pulled the thing out? Pause. They pull the thing out uh-huh. and then they flash you. That did not translate well. <laughs> <But> they, uh, <laughs> they pull the thing out and they flash you and then you just forget what happened. A forget neuralizer. me not. Neuralizer. Yeah, neuralizer. Yes, sir. Send in forget me know. nots. Yes, sir. Spider Man. Spider Man. Now y'all know what happened at the end of the last movie. No, I don't. Mysterio revealed it to the world that Peter Parker was Spider Man. But this trailer is going on right now as we speak. You know that, right? They watch it. They they can't hear it. Oh, you want them to hear it? I'm I listening, can change I'm the, listening I can change to DJ. Okay, shut sh- shut your okay, face. Okay, okay, I'm listening okay. to DJ. Please describe the, so the rest the of it. The end of last movie, Mysterio reveals to the world that Peter Parker is Spider Man. Mm-hmm. Peter is worried about this because now everybody knows who he is. Yes, sir. So this man come home doing the homework. He go to bed ready for school tomorrow. Somebody can come in and bust his head. Okay. He don't want that. All right. Gotcha. Gotcha. So he goes to Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange knows magic. He knows I magic. Heard. I heard. I heard. <laughs> right. Just in case y'all ain't. I know. heard. Just in case mm-hmm. y'all ain't know. So he he can do the little swirly thing, you know what I'm saying? He knows magic. So there is right, a spell. Right. right, right. Ghost Ride the Rip. He do that thing. So there's a spell where he, that he can cast where the whole world, he doing it right now, can forget about a specific incident. Okay. Peter asks him to cast that spell for people to forget that he is Spider-Man. Right. 
But when he's doing the spell, right? Peter's talking. He's talking way too much. He's like, oh, MJ's going to forget? Ned's going to Ned's gonna forget. What about my aunt? Dr. Strange's like, shut up. I'm trying to concentrate. Shut up. Shut yeah, we up. just got to that right now. And then he messes the spell up. Shut up. DJ's talking. Now, when he messes the spell up, that creates a multiverse type of deal. Where okay. Doc Ock and I guess Electro, because he's rumored to be in the movie. Shocker. I don't, I, shocker. Yeah. Big shocker. Shocker. Negro, that's Electro. What's Electro? Shock, shocker and Electro are two different people, by the way. I just want to remind you. Yes, that's Electro is Jamie Foxx. And Doc Ock came and he said he said the famous line, Hello, Peter. So that's that's what happened. He 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 did the spell thing and messed up the multiverse. For some reason, they forgot that Kane the Conqueror was a thing, and that happened in Loki. And See, the, the multiverse thing happened in that show. Now, For check some this out. Reason. Check this out. As I'm watching Deacon play this trailer, okay, I'm I'm crippled. I'm crippled now. Uh, not only was this only possible because of Loki and Sylvie. That's it. That's it. That's they, the only reason they, why this was possible. But it's like that never happened now. No, no, it's not that like, it didn't happen. It's now it's possible because of the multiverses. You see what I mean? It wouldn't be no. possible without it. <clears throat> okay, no. Because if they didn't do Loki, right? We gotta see the movie, DJ. We gotta see the movie. No, 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 no. If they didn't do Loki, right? Okay. And Strange still did this spell. Okay. And he messed up the spell, and then they still introduced the multiverse when yes. he messed up this spell. Yes. You don't miss anything. What do you miss? He messed the spell up, and then there's a multiverse now because he must. He yeah, what, not seeing Loki and watching anything. that trailer, it still made sense. It exactly. Made sense you you don't miss a thing. So what was that all for? What was the Loki stuff all for? If if but, Doctor Strange was just gonna come in here and just trip over a rock and mess the spell up, and now all of a sudden Doc Ock and what's his face Green Goblin, everybody. So two six, things here. Everybody two, is here. Two things I, I see here. Number one, um, so one of the writers for Loki talked about the nexus of it that was created by Captain America when he went back and put the stones back but didn't come back and just lived his life with, with what's her name? White bitch, right? Peggy. Whatever the fuck her name is. Um, uh, Mrs. Hill. Mrs. Hill. <laughs> <laughs> um, so anyway, so that was a nexus event. Now you also have another one with Doctor Strange specifically ripping open the time-space continuum and introducing essentially all the Spider-Man at this point, creating the Spider-Verse, right? All of these things only happen uncorrected because of Loki. Because if those events were to happen, they would have to be corrected by the the, the, TVA. the, the TVA. Thank you, thank you. I'm glad you guys understand. So the TVA would correct those timelines. Not, right? not no, they but, they didn't, but they didn't correct Captain America saying. I was going to say. Oh, they okay. did. That is what the writer was talking about. The Nexus event that was created by Captain America was erased. Question. That's what I'm saying. Yes, answer. Not seeing Loki, couldn't they just tie the Nexus event that happened with Captain America into this multiverse fuck-up? It is. It's actually into the multiverse fuck-up. That's why there's so many branching... So, essentially, in Loki, the TVA have to correct every Nexus, Nexus event that happens, except for the apocalyptic ones, because they end up happening regardless. There's no way to stop it. No way to okay. save it. So, uh, the TVA goes in, and they eliminate that timeline, correcting the original course of time that's supposed to be consistently going forward. Without okay. the TVA, Doctor Strange, and even if she wanted to, Wanda could actually open other dimensions now uncorrected. So that's all that introduces is that the it's now no longer regulated. Doctor Strange would not be able to do this in the in the Marvel scope in 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 the time right but, he would okay. not he would technically not be able to do it if the TVA was still active but in so in, if, in Infinity if, War didn't fucking karate bitch who like taught Doctor Strange she mentioned multiverses and all that back way so back she and in, she introduced it as the Infinity Stones are the thing that keep the universe and the timeline in balance which is technically true but 
as we learned in Loki, the actual thing that keeps them in check is a power that's greater than the Infinity Stones. The thing, time. Overall, just time. Overall. That you see what I mean? Seems, that seems like a... This seems like a ploy to make people watch Loki to me. Just on the outside looking in. A little bit. really want to understand. Yeah. A little bit. But essentially all that going through watching Loki, all that introduces is now Doctor Strange can do these things unchecked. That's it. That's it. That's all that introduces. So so the timeline that when he stayed, him staying, that is gone. Yes. That that timeline is gone. Yes. Well, why See, fucking that, that, show it? Why make it a big fucking story why, why thing is, if you're gonna wreck on it? Has the shield. Y'all so... making it sound like I I wrote all this shit. <laughs> but I'm, no, I'm saying, Negro, you you present you gave me I'm the present. Ju- all I'm saying, all I'm saying is Jay, Jay, you delivered the present to me. If yes. I don't like it, I'm shooting at I, you. No, no, no. I'm just saying. It. I'm so I don't let me explain this. Let me explain. Target made it. So okay. The the one more time. The events that Loki and Sylvie do by eliminating the TVA. Now allow for Doctor Strange to be able to openly rip apart the time-space continuum, basically, right? Unchecked. So what the TVA would end up doing is when Doctor Strange creates a Nexus event, they would have to go in and eliminate that timeline, right? That's how that would work. So without that organization, he now can do all of this shit with Spider-Man. You see what I mean? Multiverse. So that timeline being erased has nothing to do with Falcon. No, 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 no. It has absolutely nothing to do with anything. No. So that, to me, sounds like I know the end of the movie. Because from what you're saying, the TVA is just going to fix the timeline in the end. The TVA. You didn't watch. No, no, no. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. You You didn't watch Loki. All right. I didn't watch Loki. Go watch Loki. Uh, I will, and I'll come back next week. Let me me tell you something. The TVA is a little busy right now. They're a little busy. They're a little busy. Yeah. They're a little busy. All right. Mm-hmm. Okay. So. Still and... seems like a shitty ploy to make someone watch Loki. Hey, but guess what? You didn't huh. watch Loki. I didn't. And it's a different perspective than the rest of y'all. So, so we need this. Yeah. So look like you got to pay that $4.99 and get you some Disney Plus, young man. I'm using somebody <laughs> else's account. Fuck that. And you still ain't watched Loki. That's crazy. Nope. That's crazy. Now, the only one that does not matter is Falcon and the Winter Soldier because those guys are just having a good time. That was that just seems yeah. like, that, that was seems just, like the, you know. the one I'm most likely to watch though. See, you say that, but then when you start watching They're it, you're like, one. are these guys just fixing this boat? That's it. Stop taking yeah. TV <laughs> shows, Marvel. Stick to movies. The, you know what? I'm gonna get into a big argument. The Loki show was good. I liked it. Loki was Side, great. I liked it. Side note, liked uh, it. good job, DJ, explaining the trailer as things were happening on screen because it seemed like you were right on pace. <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> I didn't even know that. He said, and then Doc Ock shows up, and then Doc Ock showed up. Doc Ock showed up, yeah. That man, is, that man was not even paying attention. He was just describing this is why, it. This so. is why I need to do reaction videos on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> that shit was crazy. No, no, no anime. No anime. So, uh, no anime. So now, now that we have this, okay, uh, and I get why they introduced What If in in the fashion that they introduced it. There's absolutely no way that they could do all of these technically canonical events with all of this other stuff being introduced. You see what I mean? So if there's a specific police force that is supposed to stop all of this time ripping shit, which is what they do, that's mm. their literal job, without them being mm. able to do that, time cops. now, now, yeah, without time cops being able to go and stop you, okay, you can just go in and out of time all you want to. You see what I mean? Seems a little excessive. Just as just the same way, we're gonna get the new villain going into phase four and phase five. See what I mean? Unchecked. Do we know where we're? Do we know where we're going with these phases? Do we know what sto- you don't. story? You don't. Being you told? don't. Because <laughs> you didn't, you didn't, you didn't Loki. watch Loki. You don't get to know anything. So they, I'm, they, very, they I'm, mentioned... I'm very excited. Yes, so like sir. we how we got to the Thanos fight after like the three phases, we know where we're going with these next couple phases already. So let me tell you something. You know let me that tell you something. Yeah, let me tell you something. So you know that part, which movie was that at the end where he puts the gauntlet on? Was that um Was that Guardians? I think that was Guardians. So at the I end of Guardians, Guardians, you see this big purple nigga come out and he puts this um, golden he puts this golden glove on, right? What's his name? Galactus? Yeah. Oh no, you did. Yes, sir. That's exactly what it is. That's a giant ass See, glow. this, this. Let me, let me take a second here for. I'm getting things mixed up. This is how I know 
Deacon, anytime I mention Marvel stuff, he be talking about, oh, I don't watch the TV shows. He don't watch nothing. Deacon don't watch a damn thing, okay? <laughs> he don't watch a damn thing. And we, this is very clear. Okay. I watched what transpired on Twitter the other now, day. Now, if I had to guess, Phase 8, 9, and 10 are probably going to wow. be Galactus. If I had okay. to guess. If I had to guess. So, Where the know. fuck are we going? With Celestials and all our, the, that, the Eternals and all that, that's, yeah. where, that's where that's... That's probably going to be way, way that's later. So, okay. after after this new bad, okay, that they introduced in Loki, but there's... He about to tear the, he about to tear the whole thing. There's thousands of them, essentially. A thousands of versions of this big bad guy. Right. Mm. So uh, going forward, man, I'm, I look forward. I look forward to the rest of this because it now introduces lore where the X-Men can be real now. <gasps> if we get an X-Men cameo in the new Spider-Man movie, I'm a con. Aren't we? We're supposed to get like an X. I'm a con. Uh, the next Deadpool movie is supposed to be X-Men, I think. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's in, it, it takes hey, place Mr. in the MCU. Mr. Hugh Jackman has been very involved in Marvel stuff for, for too much. For Allegedly. Me to be like. Allegedly. 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 For me, yeah, for yeah. me to be, it, it's been too much stuff I'm seeing to where ain't no way y'all ain't doing something with him. We've been around too many We may meetings. get multiple Wolverines because uh, a couple of people are uh, interested in the recasting. Q says he didn't really like playing Wolverine for thousands but of he reasons. did. But he said <laughs> he would love to do something with Ryan Reynolds, though. Oh, yeah, so yeah, yeah. That would and, be the thing to bring him back. And he has, on multiple occasions, has talked about wanting to be in the Avengers movies. So... Yeah. Kevin Feige said yesterday, hey, you know what? We're not going to get Avengers 5 for a minute. We got to set that up. So I we're mean, looking for at, the lo- at at least four years. Four years before we get the next Avengers movie. For a long time, we couldn't get um, Marvel and X-Men crossovers for legal reasons, right? Uh, yeah. Um, Fox owned the rights to X-Men and probably like, I think it was like 30% of the Marvel catalog. Sony yeah, they, owned they had Spider Man, Spider Man, X Men. Uh, Spider Man was Sony, which Fantastic. they still had. Oh, Sony was Sony. Was, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Sony had given that. Oh, up. so Fox had. Yeah, but Sony getting the money now, so Fox a lot had, more. Fox had X Men Fantastic Four. Yes, too? they did. They did. Yeah. And Ghost Rider. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, but so, no one. I don't know if they do anything with him. Ghost I, that Ghost Rider movie was great. I like yeah, the it. first one. Yeah. Yeah, the first. Yeah. One. We need some Gambit. Show. There's another one. Pretty sure. I yeah, could there's, be there's, there's, there's a, a part two, bro. Yeah, there's a pro- yeah. part two. I didn't know that shit. Yeah, you don't need to know. Don't worry about it. Hey, man, that's okay. And then Universal um, still has the rights to to Hulk. That's why Hulk yeah. can't have a solo movie. That's uh, but I mean, in recent years, is when they kind of like worked out the X Men shit, right? So we're um, they bought all of Fox, so yes, <laughs> I think oh, they worked it out. Yeah, there, yeah, there yeah, we go. That's an easy way to work it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very money, easy. The great solver <laughs> of issues. You don't want to, you don't want to rent it to us? Fine, we'll just buy the whole fucking studio. Uh, so no, he didn't. <laughs> oh so, man. But yeah, I mean, but that's only been recent uh, in the grand t- scheme of things, so it makes sense we're gonna get some crossovers now. Someone buy Konami yeah. so I can get a bloody so, horror fuck game. Off you just first of all we were games, all having a good time video games don't work the same game. way man it's just not gonna happen oh okay? man yikes all right hey, hold on to that shit like it's the last fucking cookie someone buy cookie konami jam, so we don't get another metal gear survive yeah please or another there metal gear fucking please. slot machine so i mean i nah, see i'm with y'all on that one yeah i'm kind of y'all on i'm over it all right but um anyway last thing for today uh i know i'm the only person who cares about this probably um New sure. photos of cowboy of the Cowboy Bebop Netflix series. Oh, I saw that, yeah. Yeah, I did you see saw that as well. How we how we feeling about that for people who actually watch anime? Ooh, I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all something right now. Shoot, he's me. never seen Cowboy it. Bebop. Yeah. <laughs> Why? I'm not actually. I'm actually not surprised. Yeah, I'm not surprised either. DJ just right. doesn't like good shit. Yeah. Yeah. No. Face cowboy, how do you not like? I, I actually just want to talk to Selena to be honest with you because I don't care about the rest of your opinions. Oh, yeah. so, I can excuse go. me, Selena specifically. What are you, right. what are you thinking? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Back it up, everybody. We're good. What do All I right. think? Yes, you. Yes, I love it. I they're hot. Okay, that's you know, that's how you're going to get me to watch. Okay. okay, I got sent the pictures earlier this morning because I didn't see, I didn't even know this was going to be a thing. Mm-hmm. And you know what? I'm happy that they actually got a fucking corgi, because usually <laughs> you like you thought it was gonna be a usually, digital dog. <laughs> well, no. So like, I don't know what it is about live action. Whenever they like change stuff, and there's like a certain animal, 
they always change it to like a different kind of dog. More like dogs that are easier oh to train and shit like that. Bro. So the fact that they actually here. stuck with getting a fucking corgi, thank Bro. you. That's I'm, all I gotta bro, say. I'm very. Happy I'm tired of that. seeing fucking German shepherds, golden retrievers, and a fucking corgi. I'm gonna have to Honestly, and I really like this casting. Yeah, I think it's not. I too I really enjoy just looking at the pictures that were sent. Mm. Okay. All right. I want to marry her. Yeah, I'd be corgi. Okay. Yeah, the, okay. the chick who's playing Faye, she's kind of cute. <laughs> she I is. Kind of. She's adorable. You know. Big cute. Where is I, Ayn at? I, I need, need Ayn. I need to see where Ed is. No. Show me Ed. Show me Ed and I'll be happy. The double Ed? D or what's mm -hmm. up? Not the, no. Single D. Okay. Single oh, D. Gotcha. <laughs> so. The dickhead. Yep. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I, I, I wonder who's going to play Vicious. Did they say? I don't remember Have them they... saying. You know what? I don't think it's... I. If I had to guess... Um, I don't think we're gonna get to Vicious until like way, way later. If I had to guess, I think it's gonna be a ten episode episodic, um, much like the actual anime, and we probably won't get to Vicious until maybe like the last episode, and they start introducing a connected storyline. Oh, what I think. you guys think the fucking spaceships are gonna be CGI? That would yeah, suck. Boy. That would suck. Uh... They need to do what Fast and Furious did. Maybe. Please don't do what Fast and Furious did. Please definitely do what Fast and Furious <laughs> did. That's send a, that, that send it. that Honda Fast Civic, to, send that Honda Civic to space. Mm -hmm. Let's okay. go. I'm prepared. So high key. Oh, sorry, let's go ahead. Mm -mm. Go ahead. I was gonna say high key. I think this project might make or break live action anime adaptations in the West. I, I mean. So. The last yeah. one was was Death Note. If no, I we don't talk about. No, we don't talk about we it. Don't, we nope. don't talk about that. That was not yeah, an adaptation. That. that was so far removed from the source material. It's its own thing. That was that was fan made. I think that we do talk fan about made. It. No, that was a talk college about student it. project. That is not true. I saw a fan made one after the Netflix one came out. That was actually Better. really good. Like the first, it was amazing. Two, the first two Japanese uh, live action Death Note movies were super fucking good. Mm. Why can't we get it right in the West? <laughs> The uh, live action know. Death Note one on Netflix, that was a page two Google search. Oh yeah, page two. Absolutely yikes! They, page somebody two. somebody got a, a fanfic of Death Note and they based that movie off of the fanfic. Hey, listen, they did uh, a better hello? job than that fucking Netflix garbage. That's for sure. So garbage, yeah, yeah, absolute garbage. So I don't know. I I think. It's this one is, you know, we're we're definitely at this point. If they fuck it up this time, I think that's it. I think we just wrap it up for live action movies. Like, let's just not even try it again. Just wrap it up. Meanwhile, we got this fucking UALA fucking live action thing on YouTube that smashes anything a big production company has ever tried. Hey man, I uh, I have some insider information about season two of that. But I'm uh, waiting. I can't. I can't reveal anything. No, uh, so. NDA is not up yet. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. And these black people are serious. Like they're very serious. I saw so, it, bro. It's good. They're um. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't casted in it, but I will be watching it when it comes out. I got oh, my absolutely. yeah. I got my screener, so okay. I'm yeah. very excited for it. But anyway, that is pretty much it for today's podcast. Any anything anybody want to add? Like anything you want to get off your chest for this week? How y'all feeling? I feel like great. I'm like, tired. I'm, I'm close to being being taken over this YouTube scene, allegedly. Mm. So I'm feeling like great. Why you say Why you say allegedly? Like you about to commit a crime? It is because he wants, plausible, he wants plausible. He wants plausible deniability if it don't work. <laughs> True. The they have I... meat meat moi at the top. Okay, just wait. Right. Just wait. Just wait. Did I tell you what they think of the video? What they thought of it? No, what did oh they think? Oh my, here we go. What did the they dude, think? The dude, the dude said, I knocked it out of the park. I bet, said, he, I, I bet did, he did. I did amazing. I bet he did say that. Yeah. They send you yeah. your money yet? Yeah, they about to. Oh, okay. They about oh, to. They, they, so they haven't yet. So they haven't yet. Yeah, they gave him a tracking pigeon. number. Pigeon. The money Pigeon. is in transition. Uh -huh. It's in the mail. It's in the mail. It's they send the you mail. USPS or UPS? We don't know. Carrier Pigeon. It might be FedEx. You ain't even got a tracking number yet. They sent you USD, right? 
Not schmeckles or anything like that? Yeah. They paid him in rubles. They paid him in rubles. Yeah, nothing like that. Dude, like we're that. Yeah. paying you an exposure. What do you mean? Oh, my God. Hey, man. That's, yeah. yo, I tried to tell him. I'd be like, be careful how they do that. Oh, yeah, we'll yeah. we'll give you exposure. All right. Yeah, yeah, we'll shout you out on Instagram. Yeah, expose these nuts to you, man. Hey, how man, look. That? I'm a... I'm going to just see. I'm going to see where it goes, man. These companies will try to take advantage of you, man. So, Real you know, quick. I believe in you. I believe yeah. in you. I am very so. I'm very pleased with the the reception that I that I got from this interview. He pat himself on the back right we'll now. We'll see what happens when, when they throw it up on the channel. So, All right. We'll see what All happens. All right. Well, like <sighs> with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this week's episode of the Canon Culture Podcast, make sure you uh, let us know on social media. Everybody's uh, links are going to be down in the description. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe to the podcast. It's available on iTunes, Spotify, and anywhere you listen to your local podcast, I guess. Um, man, this was great. This is a great comeback episode. Um, some of y'all got a little disgusting. Yeah. Arrow. Are you specifically? Oh. You, I was going to say, who brought up these topics? <laughs> anyway. You were the dude watching it. You were watching porn with the boys, which I can I can respect, but goddamn. For, was you not the, the boy? Sir, okay. Okay. was it's you not different. one of the boys? It's a different thing. No, sir. Like, <laughs> no, sir. Let me find out. These these youngins let don't understand. Yeah. You were the boys? No. When, you, when you got six people wanting to watch, but one tape and one VCR? Come on. Having to rewind it over and over and over again per person just gets annoying, bro. It's yeah. just easier in a group set. You know what? I said too much. Anyway, thank you guys for listening <laughs> to this week's of Canon Culture. We'll catch you guys next week. Make sure to keep it canon.